Hello today's video we have the following content. Zhang Han's version of Erlang Shen and Maggie Chun's version of Iron Fan Princess. Black Myth Wukong's face to face hits the hot search. Netizens, the more you look at them, the more they look alike. It's exactly the same, the more you look at them, the more they look alike. China's first 3A standalone game Black Myth, Wukong has swept major social platforms, and the image design of the major characters in the game has also aroused extensive discussion among players and netizens. Many people said that Erlang Shen Yang Jian unexpectedly has a wonderful similarity with the famous actor Zhang Han in facial contour and temperament. Others were surprised to find that other characters in the game also have faces like celebrities, directors, anime characters, etc., and they repeatedly sighed. How can they look a bit alike at first glance, but look completely different when you look closely? Erlang Shen and Elder Jinxi have faces like Zhang Han and Li Bin? They all responded. On August 25th, topics such as Black Myth Wukong Yang Jian actor responds to having a face like Zhang Han were trending on Weibo. In the latest interview, Wang Guahe OG, a post-90s actor who participated in the modeling of Erlang Shen Yang Jian, responded to the fact that he looked like Zhang Han and other actors. Everyone looks a bit like someone, which is normal, but I am me. It is understood that Wang Guaheoji is from Changde, Hebei, born in 1993, and graduated from the Central Academy of Drama. On the Sihu platform, his personal profile is a young actor who is working hard and his certification information is an actor in Warrior Glory. On his personal social platform, Wang Guaheoji also shared his mental journey, what? Like teacher Zhang Han? Like teacher Zhang Binayu? Even some people compared it with teacher Jiao Mjin, and I was flattered. Wang Guahei Oji said that as an actor, these are all his predecessors, and he will humbly accept all voices, learn from and pay tribute to his predecessors. Picture source Zia Huangshu screenshot Wang Guahei Oji also revealed that in order to keep confidentiality, Wang Guahei Oji did not know that he was Erlang Shen when he participated in the facial collection, and he only found out recently. At the same time, he also hopes that everyone should focus on the game experience. I am very happy to be involved in the project. I love playing games. Everyone has his own Erlang Shen and his own Black Myth Monkey King in his heart, and Mr. Jiao Engine is also the Erlang Shen in my mind. Some netizens also joked that the villain Elder Jin Chi looked like Li Bin, the founder of Neo, and even changed a line in the game since you see the future, why not worship to since you see Neo, why buy it? Photo source, Daoian screenshot. In the comment area, Li Bin also responded to netizens calling out, Many people sent me emoticons, everyone should support domestic products in various fields. The whole network spontaneously compiled a collection. Do you think these characters with similar faces look alike? I'm so fascinated by Princess Iron Fan's beauty. The more I look at her, the more she looks like an old friend. After Erlang Shen looked like Zhang Han and Elder Jin she looked like Li Bin, everyone was fascinated by Princess Iron Fan again. Some netizens said that even the white-haired Princess Iron Fan still had charm, and her close-up charm was very similar to Maggie Chun. Some netizens also suggested that Maggie Chun could be invited to play in the movie version. I'm looking forward to it. Source, screenshot of Daoyan. On major platforms, netizens posted various similar moments and spontaneously built a collection. Let's take a look. Do you think they look alike? In the game, the spider spirit looks like Li Bingbing, Pingping looks like Zin's Hillary. And Kang Jin Long looks like Amber Kuo. Netizens exclaimed that the oriental beauty is amazing. Some people found that Zubeji looked like the little pig demon in the animation Little Monster Summer. Once upon a time there was a Lang Lang Mountain, and the real body of Marshall Cheyenne Peng looked like Chinese Taiwanese actor Zhou Yumin. Some people also said that Cheyenne Mingren and the director of the Wandering Earth Kuo fan are somewhat similar. Are there any familiar faces in this game that you can't remember? Welcome to leave a comment in the comment section to discuss. Next news. Comparing Zhao Lin and Liu Yifri, the 285 flowers, the difference is obvious at a glance. There are many female stars in the entertainment industry, and the most impressive ones are the well-known 85 flowers, who are also the focus of many viewers. Take Zhao Lin and Liu Yifri as examples. Both of them have performed well in both acting and appearance. In recent years, the number of their film and television works has continued to increase, and their careers are booming. Even though they are born after 85, there is no trace of time on their faces. The immortal myth may refer to Zhao Lin and Liu Yifri. First of all, let's talk about the fairy sister Liu Yifri. 
With the popularity of the hit drama The Story of Roses, the 36-year-old perfectly interprets the role of a beautiful woman in her 20s, which is easy for her. The temperament of Wang Yimei is fully displayed by Liu Yifri. Liu Yifri made her mark in the entertainment industry at the age of 15 with her pew-removing appearance. Her role as Wang Yui in Demigods and Semi-Devils made the title of Sister Fairy deeply rooted in the hearts of the audience. In terms of appearance, Liu Yifri's beauty is almost impeccable. Although she is over 30 years old, her innate temperament is still unmatched. In terms of performance, Liu Yifri preferred costume martial arts dramas in the early days. In Legend of Sword and Fairy, she played Xiao Linger and showed an outstanding girlish temperament, natural and unpretentious. The 16-year-old Liu Yifri amazed the audience. Regarding the role of Xiao Linger, some netizens commented, as far as her hairline is concerned, it is just right, adding a delicate atmosphere to the role. In junior high school, when I didn't have a clear concept of beauty, Liu Yifri attracted me involuntarily. If the teenage Liu Yifri represented the innocent beauty of girlhood, then today she shows the unique charm of a mature woman. In the years since her debut, Liu Yifri has never had any scandals with any male actors, and her spiritual connotation is worth learning from. In this era when the medical beauty industry is prevalent, Liu Yifri has no body anxiety at all. Her natural face makes people feel comfortable. And although her shoulders are not perfect, she still confidently shows her back. She doesn't mind the slight weight gain at all, and her beauty really radiates from the inside out. She always has a relaxed atmosphere and clearly distinguishes her career from her life. In a sense, Liu Yifri is like Wang Yimui in the early stage of the story of Roses, the confident and elegant character next to Zhang Guodong. In Wang Yimui, the hopelessness and helplessness of women in love are reflected. After experiencing Zhang Guodong's cold violence, Wang Yimui chose to go to the United States alone without even a word of negotiation. When she collapsed and broke the bottle, this scene seemed to resonate with many women in love. I admire Liu Yifri very much. This is the recognition of netizens. Compared with Liu Yifri, the fairy sister, Zhao Liying, as a member of the 85 Flowers, is no less inferior. Zhao Liying can be described as going against the wind. Compared with many actresses in the entertainment industry, her background is not prominent. Even in the most difficult moments, she encountered accusations from directors and doubts from the audience, and even the characteristic of round face became a reason for not being able to play the female number one. However, Zhao Liying did not feel frustrated. After years of struggle, she has grown from a small supporting role of a rural girl to a heroine in 18 years. The first time I saw Zhao Liying on the big screen was in the popular TV series New My Fair Princess in 2011. Although the role of Kinger was not important, it still left a deep impression on the audience of this quirky girl. Who said that round faces can only play maids? Can actresses with round faces only become stereotyped clone faces through medical beauty methods? Zhao Liying proved this with her strength. 2013 was the year when Zhao Liying played the heroine for the first time. With the popularity of Legend of Lushen, the image of Lushen symbolizing truth, goodness and beauty was widely loved by the audience. From an ordinary palace maid to a female prime minister, the role of Lushen seems to reflect Zhao Liying's current real state. When talking about the glorious period of Zhao Liying's career, we must not ignore the flower journey that swept the country that year. Flower Journey is a costume martial arts drama. Since its launch, it has quickly won the first place in ratings and set a record for weekly dramas. This achievement is obviously obvious to all. In Flower Journey, Zhao Liying vividly showed the simplicity and kindness of the character in the early stage, which matched her once underestimated round face just right. Until Hua Tiangu turned black, her grasp of the role transformation was equally accurate. In terms of acting, Zhao Liying is indeed impeccable. For Zhao Liying, the filming of costume dramas is simply handy. Through the work Do You Know, the role of Sheng Minglin quickly became famous and the thinking she brought to women is an extremely valuable asset. Especially Minglin, who was later named Lady of Imperial Concubine, her eyes and temperament changed. She was no longer bullied by anyone and finally ushered in her own glorious moment. There is no doubt that Zhao Liying performed very well in costume dramas, and her performance in modern urban emotional dramas is also worthy of praise. Since she got married and became a mother, her acting career has taken a step further. Some netizens commented, the change is really amazing. In the book Wind Blowing Bangsha, there is a line that says I never make a wish, because things go against my wishes. This seems to truly reflect the traces of time in Su Bangsha's eyes. In fact, her dream has never been realized. 
Jalain, in the newly released movie Article 20 this year, tried to play the mother of a deaf-mute disabled person for the first time, which is undoubtedly a huge challenge for all actors. However, Jalain interpreted this role very well, and the helplessness and pain of the exploitation of the lower class that she showed made it easy for the audience to resonate. The hand she stretched out on the rooftop are still impressive. Many netizens said, compared with them, Zha Liain's acting is really outstanding. In fact, Zha Liain and Liu Yifei grew up in different backgrounds. If we want to point out an obvious difference, we can probably say that Zha Liain has added some marks brought by time. After all, everyone's experience is unique, and it is difficult to fully understand the feelings of others, so the characters they portray also appear different. The entertainment industry has always been full of outstanding talents. People like Zha Liain and Liu Yifei occupy an irreplaceable position in both acting and appearance. It is because of such outstanding actors that the entertainment industry can continue to launch more high-quality works. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel,